Hey, welcome to the second episode of Splatoon 2 with PvP Plays. I'm Demisi, taking you through Splatoon 2 single player. So, uh, we're gonna go off and find level 3 now. I've already got a trail inked right up to it and got it uncovered in the last uh, episode. So just gonna jump right in. And... Oh, what is it doing? Alright, whatever. Step on that dash track, just trust me, trust me on this. Alright. Sorry, I'm trying to rearrange things and not set up particularly well here. Whoosh! Gets your ink pumping, huh? Yeah, that's pretty cool. Let's do that again. And... Whee! Oh yeah, jump over obstacles. Oh yeah, I have a jump button. Her. Yeah. Get splatted. The jump training course. What is this? Ooh, a ride rail. Shoot it to turn it on, then jump on and enjoy the ride. Nicely done. Oh, cool. I get the skater grind now, too. And... Jump farther, yeah, that I do. Let's spot that guy, let's see. Do we have anything hidden around here? This is always the type of place I like to hide things. No? Alright. Go this way. Eggs! Alright, onion rings! Ready? Huh. Ink pistons. I don't recommend you touch those. Yeah, they they do not look like something I wanna, wanna play with. No, seriously, don't touch those. Thanks. Armor. Ah! Well, that was almost some poor timing. Give me that. Oh, my fish. Where did I get it? Give me the fish. I gotta come from the other direction. Please. Alright, let's see. Can we make this jump? Yes! And back! What a player. A game player. Am I super armored now? Yeah. <laughs> This way. Trick jump! Hey! Oh man. Timing is the key to a long and existing life. Are you telling me I'm gonna die here? Ha! Easy! Of course I stick with landing. Go, 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 go! Yeah! Ooh! Onion rings! I think I'm as armored as I'm gonna get. What is this? Stingray. Hey, 
I didn't kill anything with that. I was gonna get right up in your faces and gun you down. What a player. Yeah, that she thinks I'm a player. Who we got? Ooh, Twintacle Octo Trooper. That was some quality splattage, Agent 4. More onion rings! Uh oh. Did I miss stuff? Yeah, I missed stuff. There's no going back. Hopefully, that wasn't the sunken scroll. Onion ring! Grind rail! It was the second scroll. Damn it. Okay, well, we missed one. Shit happens. Bonus, I got ten orbs for having extra armor. And the boss kettle is unlocked. Alright, so we'll wreck this boss for this episode. Definitely got time for that. Stick around for the good stuff. Let's see, what do we got? Come here. Industrial toast into the octo oven. Let's do this. Into the goop. Oh, well, this is horrifying. Four hundred and twenty five degrees of pain in the octo oven. Okay. The ends of the loaves look deadly. Do I never eat the end slice? Oh. I did not ink enough. Don't quite know what to do with this. Get up to the top. I'm sure of that. Go, 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 go! Yeah, suck it! Donut, stop! You need to keep going. Oh, God, the puns. Oh, jeez. What are you? Mmm, churros. Wait, nope. They're just columns of death. But there are fewer walls in the oven to climb now. Uh, yeah. That's definitely a problem, huh? No, climb! Get him! Suck it! Gosh! Good, but do not start loafing around or things might go awry. The buttons! Oh god, the buttons! This is... Wait, armored bread? But armor? On bread? Uh, some kind of blazing machine has appeared. Uh, yeah. Oh, Jesus. Uh! Ah! Uh, run! Run, Inkling, run! <laughs> kind of get some of that upper stuff inked for when he goes into rage mode and I can 
climb him. Here we go. Here we go. Uh. All right. And up. Go up. Got him. Yes. And victory. This guy's toast. Yes. Your toast has been burnt. Ah, it screamed in horror as it exploded. I got a mackerel. There's no sunken scroll here. All right, well, we'll save our zapfish. Seems good for now. Industrial toast. Yay! Good work, Agent Four. I sure know how to pick them. Gotta hand it to the Actarians, though. I didn't expect them to have fully operational octobosses at their disposal. I think it's time to call in the big guns. Let's see here. Sheldon, can you hear me? Over. I hear you loud and clear, Marie. Over. Oh, man, this is so cool. <clears throat> Agent 4, I'm Sheldon from Ammo Knights. The only weapon shop in Inkopolis with over 452 million years of trusted services. That's right, stop by Ammo Knights in Inkopolis Square for all your weapon needs. Tell me Sheldon sent you. Marie told me everything. To think that my signature weapons can be of help to the new Squid Beak Spatoon? I'm... S I'm flattered. But I'm afraid I ju can't just let you treat my vast arsenal like an all-you-can-ink buffet. I do have a business to run, you know. So let's help each other out. I want you to help me test out some new weapons I'm currently developing. All you have to do is use them in real-world conditions. If you'll do that for me, I'll be able to gather all sorts of amazing data. That data will help me get the approvals I need to make retail versions of the weapons. And once the retail versions are out, you can use them in turf war battles. It's a real win-win, don't you think? Oh, yeah! And... Okay, down, boy. I think Agent 4 gets the point. Let's get back to work, Agent 4. Stay fresh! Alright! Well, thanks for tuning in to Episode 2. And we will catch you next time. Remember to like, share, and subscribe. Catch you later.